Carson and I are headed to meet Amber, who is my best friend and business partner, and we are going to film some content for Greedy Girls Atlanta, which is our brand. We are food bloggers, and we've been doing this since 2019. So follow us on Instagram, at Greedy Girls Atlanta. Follow us on YouTube, at The Greedy Girls. Follow us on TikTok, at The Greedy Girls. We've been doing this since 2019, but we've been taking small breaks in between. COVID hit, we had to take a break. I got pregnant, we took a break after I gave birth. In terms of consistency, we're really just trying to find our rhythm because there's two of us. So it's, I can do things alone, but it's alone, but it's always better when we do them together because it's a joint brand, right? Engagement, we are just now about to hit 10,000 organic followers on Instagram and very happy about that. And while we have been getting engagement, growing our account to just 10,000, it was not easy. I'm gonna be honest, it was not easy. We tried a lot of things. We tried follow for follow. We joined different groups where, you know, there were other upcoming foodies where you post and we go tell the group that we posted and everybody goes and likes everybody's stuff and shares everybody's stuff. We tried that, that worked well for a while. I have been um, shying away from doing things during the week because my husband's working in the past I felt like I couldn't bring my son with me but now that he's a little older he's fine like he does great in restaurants I brought his iPad he hasn't had it all day so he's gonna be excited when he gets it and it'll be fine like I said I wasn't using my son's not in daycare as an excuse I'm just gonna make it do what it do because it's other mom content creators and baby they be making content with their babies so I'm gonna make content with my baby too okay look I'm not even about to play with y'all oh you see this makeup I be my face down I know y'all are used to seeing me looking for real regular but trust me when I'm outside ain't nothing regular about me baby so don't catch me outside okay <laughs> but yes we're on our way to Postino Wine Cafe it's in Midtown, it's new. I've never been here before. I know it's a wine cafe, but it's early enough to where Carson being with me, it's not gonna be a whole lot of drinking going on. I don't think I'm gonna drink anyway. And plus, he needs to get out of the house. Like, my son deserves to experience life as well. He don't have to be cooped up in no house. Daycare, his grandparents' house, not the only place he can go, baby. Take that baby with you. Take that baby with you. Get what you gotta get done. Take that baby with you. I know that's right. And that's why we are here, honey. Because mama needs some wine for the house. So I'm right in there. You in there doing something, eating something. Ooh, super cute. Here, we're gonna get some great content out of here. Hey, baby! We're gonna get some great content out of here. I absolutely cannot wait. And I love going somewhere where it's super empty because I don't need people staring at me wondering what I'm doing. What y'all doing? Where about yourself? Everybody, this is my best friend, Amber. Isn't she beautiful? Thank you. Best friends since, best friends since, best friends since. Whenever we have a content date, we try to get as much footage as possible. We will each take videos of ourselves, of each other, of the food, and later on in the day, we will sync up with the videos and pictures that we have and plan out how we're going to use the content moving forward. I always like to get a little mom footage because I love sharing that on my personal page. Carson is my little pride and joy, so it's always fun and cute to do a couple of mom things with him. I like to show behind the scenes even there as well. We are headed home. Unfortunately, caught up in some rush hour traffic. But Carson did great. He just watched his iPad. He didn't cry. He didn't buzz. He did want to get out of his stroller. And so I, you know, took him outside, let him walk around for a minute. And then we came back to our seats. But all in all, 
it was a successful day of content creation. We ate, we drank, we filmed, and we got out of there. It's a 4.30. I'll probably start cooking dinner at 5.30, get Carson in the bath, and we're going to be getting ready for bed after that. I mean, the day in the life. The day in the life of a working mom.